Brake caliper covers. Brake caliper covers. Rice? Nice? Rice or nice? Yeah. Rice? <laughs> <laughs> guys so today we're going to talk about uh these brake caliper covers that i got for the g37 as some of you guys may know uh this car isn't actually mine it's my lady's my lady and um you have a hat you could have my lady <laughs> and uh uh there was literally no reason to get akabonos or brembos for this thing because we don't need the performance it's an automatic all-wheel drive sedan that she drives primarily yeah she doesn't care about that stuff but we also did upgrade the wheels and after painting the brakes it just didn't pop as much they as did. i wanted they, it they to were, they were pretty dull looking yeah. still and then we painted them like a relatively kind of bright color yeah and they were still pretty dull so i i came across these uh, caliper covers from a company called mgp um and they were on sale i think i think the i paid like 140 dollars for the set it was like really set, set front back or set just front? the whole thing yeah the that's front and cheap. back that's so when you're talking about an akabono big brake upgrade you're looking at if you bought the the kit used i mean your best case scenario you go to power stop and you get the 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 big brake upgrade kit you're still looking at a thousand dollars for everything well like we got pretty lucky with the brembos for the z and we still paid 500 dollars for calipers yeah and so. we still need to get Parts. uh all the rest of the parts which is going to be at least another 500 dollars just to get that on the z so let's take a look at these the this is the front right here they do come in two different sizes we should note because we do have a different size front and rear yes so i got these on sale which means that i got them with the mgp logo and the uh, simulated rivets simulated um but I'm actually not mad at it. You can actually have them choose to have them do like any color. You can also and do uh, like if you have a Dodge. This is the rear. The on. Yeah, you, you can have, have them do uh, official logos for like Infinity, Nissan, Dodge, Acura, whatever brand you got. Yeah. Um, you can do any color that you want. You can do with simulated bolts, without simulated bolts. Exactly. Um, and uh, you know, I've seen these are they're very popular on the. Um, american muscle crowd like i've seen them on a lot of challengers chargers camaros um and i think they look good for, for, the, for the price you paid yeah they actually do look pretty cool and you know they're not trying to be they're they're covers and they look yeah. like covers they look and like they're break they're literally advertised as brake dust covers so it's not like we're trying to do i'm not trying to run like a fake brembo a uh, caliper cover that looks like an actual big brake kit. It's this is this is very clearly a brake dust cover. I know that a lot of people have very strong feelings about this, but I think it looks good. I'm not trying to pretend I have something that I don't. So it, uh, you know, so at the whatever. end of the day, like for example, these JNC wheels are NK NTO3 reps, and I still have the JNC center cap because you know what? It, it looks cool. It doesn't matter. I don't care. <laughs> so let's take the wheel off and you can take a look because we actually have to uh, take a look at this brake today anyway. So let's do that. Okay, so this is what the cover looks like with the wheel off. Um, as you can see, we've got the stock brake, non-big brake under it. Um, these will not work on big brakes and I don't know why you would cover them anyways. That's fair. Um, as you can see, like we were talking about before, uh, we did paint them like an anodized red. Um, but it's you, very dark. Yeah, it's very dark. You can see that the, the caliper itself, the stock caliper, is very dusty, but the cover is not very dusty. And you've never cleaned them. And I've never cleaned them, and it's, uh, you know, it's actually done its job very well. You know, the the wheels has stayed very clean, all things considered. So, yeah, no, like, as a dust cover, that works really good. No. I it, won't even lie, that works really well, because actually you see a lot of dust on the back side of the caliper. Yeah. And you don't anywhere Here, else. Let's swipe this just so you can see. Like that's not bad. That is not bad. I've had these caliper covers for like a, a year, year and a half. Yeah. Almost two years now. It'll it'll be two year soon. <laughs> In like three months it'll be two years. So And like that's great. You've never cleaned them once. Not one time. Yeah. That's like literally the first time I've touched them just now. So that's um, great. Yeah. They they do a real good job as great caliper dust covers. Yep. So uh, in order to install them, it's very straightforward. They come with these uh, little brackets here. You just have to basically hook them onto the stock caliper uh, from the top and from the bottom. And then you, uh, it comes with a paper shim, which I believe was 0.3 mil. 
um, which you basically just stuff in here to make sure that the rotor uh, can, can rotate freely. And not contact. And not contact, bracket. because then that would cause some major issues. Um, and once it rotates free, you just slide the caliper cover on and tighten it down. Make sure it's still rotating freely and you're done. So the entire thing, like assuming you have all four wheels off already, the entire install is like 15 minutes. Yeah, really it is. Piece of cake. Yeah, but if you have to, you know, it'll take longer if you gotta like one wheel, put it down, one wheel, put it down. Yeah. But past that, it, it's a pretty quick install. Yep. Okay, so that'll do it for our MGP brake caliper cover, dust cover review. Fake um, calipers. Fake calipers, if but you, not if really. If you're so inclined to call them. If you're so inclined. Uh, let us know what you think of them if you're considering getting some. To be honest, if, if you just want something that looks shiny under your wheels and you've got big wheels and... And you don't want to paint things? And you don't want to paint them or you just don't want to get big brakes because you don't have any reason to, these are a good buy. No, like for the 140 bucks you paid, they're fantastic. I would do it again. And, and like we talked about, you know, they blocked a lot of the dust. It yeah. doesn't... Yeah. actually very effective it actually worked really well yeah it on did. top of it you know yeah totally so, so uh let us know what you guys think of these leave a comment down below and if you like the video please make sure to like subscribe and ring the notification bell and we'll see you in the next one we appreciate you guys